I have eight Bed Wars Pros, and they're going through six insane challenges, and the last person standing wins a thousand Robux. For challenge number one, these pros need to simply tell a bridge from here to here. This may be insanely easy, but the challenges later on are anything but that. But for now, let's get it started. All right, our first contestant is Twilight. Uh, uh, bro, bro, he's going without blocks. Okay, he was uh, he was supposed to go here, but he uh, ended up, you know, going over there. But yeah, that still counts. You can tell him. But now let's see if DV Gorilla can pull this off. Yeah, that's a... Uh, that's a successful telebridge, all right. All right, now let's see if Womp Womp can. <gasps> Yo, he's about to mess up. Bro, he literally almost messed up in the beginning. All right, let's see if Paige can. Ugh, and he clutches it by a near inch. I'm very surprised these Nightmare Rank players are clutching it up in the first round. Usually people fail a simple telebridge like this. And let's see if Reaper Angel is one of those people. Okay. <laughs> Oh, these are some of the best players in the game. Hey, they're pros for a reason. But this is the easiest. Out of all of the challenges, I know they're gonna fail the next one. Watch how a real nightmare player does it. All right, bet. All right, let's see. Oh, bro is a real nightmare rank player. Okay, bro is very much so a real, bro is still going. All right, bro, bro is, bro is, <laughs> bro is taking his time in the air. But let's see if the Davey can. Time. Oh! Bro, that was a perfect telebridge by him. Easy, dang. All right, all right. I can tell he's nightmare ranked by that. And for our final contestant, we have the grade. And uh, yeah, yeah, he, he easily did that. Wow, are these players good. Not one nightmare ranked player got eliminated this first round. But I have a feeling that's not a change. Because now for the second challenge, I placed a clone of myself. One thousand blocks away they only have one chance and one shot to hit the target 1000 blocks away if they miss they get eliminated but if they make it they move on all right let's see if Paige can hit the target oh they do they barely miss bro they hit my they hit the clone at its freaking kneecap that was close now let's see if twilight can hit this shot he misses! He misses the call! There's no way! Get banned. And now we have Vayne. Let's see if his aim is better than Twilight's. He hits it! Let's go! Now let's see if Gorilla can make the shot. And he hits the shot! Gorilla moves on. Now let's see if Wombop can do it. And he hits as well! Now let's see if the Grade can do it. And he hits a headshot! Oh my gosh! There's only two who haven't attempted it yet. Let's see if they can actually follow through and complete the trick shot. Let's see if Reaper can do it. He hits him! Bro, he barely hit him on his shoe! Now for our final Nightmare Rank player, we have Friend. Will he hit it? He hits the shot! What a clutch play by him. We're only left with seven Nightmare Rank players right now. But that's about to change. Because for round three, players have to make it across this 100 block magma wall with only one block. Okay, let's see if Womp can make this happen. Yo, he's figured it out! Any slight mishap and you're going straight to the magma. Let's see if Womp can pull this off. <gasps> he can't mess up now! And he messes up at the end! Well, that means Womp gets the boot. Time for Reaper to pull this off. Let's see if he can do this. Bro dies instantly. Goodbye. Let's see if Vayne can clutch up. What is bro? Yo, this is actually a smart strat by him. Yo, he might actually have a strat here. He goes all the way up so he doesn't risk falling to his death. What? There's no way. There's all right. Well as a nightmare player. He thought outside the box GG's all right Let's see if friend can pull this off. That was such a high IQ strat I literally had to block off the top bro is all right. This guy is moving fast. He is efficient He is calculated this guy knows what he's doing. He just can't mess up if you go insanely fast You die insanely quick if you mess up slightly, but he is not messing up like a nightmare player All right, it's time for gorillas turn 
Bro uses his anti-cheat moderator perms to hack and uh, give him the win. You know what? I didn't say anything against that. Yeah, I don't think Degradable has the anti-cheat moderator hoverboard or the ability to go to the top. As we can see, these Nightmare Rank players are really thinking outside of the box. I think Degradable is going to die. I can just tell. I can just tell he doesn't have this down. This is risky for him. Yeah, he's going to hit it and die. Just like that. GG's, bro. And that leaves us with only one player left one wall in front of him let's see if Paige can pull this off yo this is a smart play by him getting to the top or no, no please tell me he's not please tell me please tell me he's not please you're kidding me you're actually kidding. all right whatever bro it's clearly showing how high iq these nightmaring players are I would have never thought of that. And with that, we went from seven to four. Now it's time for the challenges to get even harder because for challenge four, each one of these players are gonna have to play a solo game. If they can't win the solo game that they're queuing up into next and I'm spectating, they get eliminated. All right, the first player we're spectating is Vayne. Let's see if he can clutch up. He hasn't played it all today in solo. So hopefully he can pull off the W. Is he? Is he fishing? There's no way this guy is fisherman kid. What is bro thinking? Let's see if Van can cook up. He, he's fisherman. I don't know what bro is thinking, but he is. He he is comboing this kid. That guy didn't even get a hit of damage on him. And he is getting comboed. Yo, he's dead. There's no way. But Vayne refuses to give up. He may have gotten knocked into the void, but he will not go down without a fight. Oh, but he finally gets a good kill. Somebody tries to break comboed easy. Bro, hit him once. But let's see if that yap is going to pay off and he catches the W. If he doesn't, he gets instantly eliminated and loses the chance of winning the Robux prize at the end. Oh, he pearls. <gasps> and he's going to get the bed. Yo, but he gets low as well. No way, he might actually be low. Oh, no, he's not. He's not. He's just... Yeah, Vayne takes the W in the most craziest manner ever. Okay, we're spectating friend. But a little thing happened. His buddy literally stream sniped him. So he's not only playing regular players, he, he, he's also facing the top ranked Nightmare players. And he's getting comboed in the beginning of the game. There's no way bro is losing to these new players. Oh my gosh. Friend might not win this. I'm not even gonna lie, bro. It's not looking good for him. But Friend is a pro Davy. Th this guy is one of the best Davies in the game. Let let's see if bro can Davy. What the? No, this guy. This guy is insane with Davy. What the heck? A friend is just dominating this lot. Wow, bro. This guy is the best Davy in the game. What is going on? His buddy Vane is that. That is literally his buddy that stream sniping him. He needs to watch out. And he, he falls into the void. Ooh, but he pearls away. A good play. Yeah, considering when you're getting stream sniped by your best buddy. His neighbor is not as stacked as him anymore. He can win this. Oh my gosh. The oh my. What a Davy play by friend. This guy is such a good Davy. It's impressive. He breaks the bed plating. And I have a feeling he's about to get the bed shield as well. Oh my goodness. Yo, chill out, bro. He just perfectly combos that player but besides getting the bed he has to worry because his friend and him are the only people left it's only friend and the stream sniper Vayne oh this is not gonna be good for him because Vayne is competing for the robux as well everything friend has everything to lose while Vayne Oh, he gets pearl on! He gets pearl on out of nowhere! But he needs to watch! Oh my gosh! Bro got jumped! I was not ready for that. That has me lost for words. Friend finds a perfect way to evade that fight while Vayne's only attempt to catch him off guard fails. And Friend catches the W, regardless of stream snipers. Nobody is stopping this guy from getting the win. Friend and Vayne move on, but let's see if Gorilla and Inhaler can as well. Okay, it's time to spectate Gorilla. What? What? Kit? Oh, he's Electra. I just know he's going to win this game. He's not using any regular kit. He's using the, the sweatiest solo kit ever. I have a feeling bro is going to catch this W along with the two other Nightmare Rank players that won. I thought people were going to get knocked off in this round. However, it's looking like... It's looking... Gorilla is just slapping up this poor player. 
Looks like it's bro's first time playing the game, but uh, it might be its last time as well. Oh my gosh. Oh, bro. Bro managed to kill this guy four times. What? Yeah, he just left the... <laughs> Bro just reset. Bro said, have a great day. I I'm I am not fighting you. Gorilla gets all the emeralds at mid, and with that, gets a crossbow. It's it's not looking good for these players in the game. Gorilla's going in for the kill right here. Oh my gosh. Electra dash and the crossbow to finish him off. Bam. GG's, buddy. Gorilla hops in, gets the bed, and just completely slaps this player up. But he is playing tactical here. He's saving him for once he can break the bed. And in five seconds, yeah, this player is going back to the lobby. He's gonna take a nice, nice trip back to the spawn queue. GG's, buddy. You can try your hardest to combo Gorilla. Gorilla literally played so good, he, uh, yeah, he made my game crash. But there was still one player left. And that's Inhaler. Alright, what kit is bro running? Ooh. Davy as well. This map is extremely hard to use Davy on. So let's see if Inhaler can clutch this up. He is getting rushed by a player with Terra and he gets comboed in the beginning. I don't know if Bro can carry on. I don't know if Bro can win this game. Inhaler finds a way to kill the player, but not without losing all of his iron and taking an insane amount of damage. Poor kid with the ninja. Ugh, yeah, I'm sorry. Bro had one chance in the beginning to kill Inhaler, but nah, nah, nah. Bro gave Inhaler a Davy Cannon. There, there's no point. You're just wasting time by still playing this game because you just got previously comboed. Bed broken. Inhaler isn't that invincible anymore, bro. This guy went from the hunter to the hunted. I, I'm just kidding. He absolutely just bullies that guy. Sends him back to the lobby. Says, have a nice day. And there is only one player left. A, a, a level eight. Oh, no. Oh, my. Bro, chill. Bro's base is getting World War bombarded. And Haley's about to kill this poor player with only TNT. Bro, just let the poor kid that got off school on his mom's tablet play the game. Yeah. And Haley catches the W as well. Wow, I thought these nightmaring players were all we were gonna lose one game at least, but I forgot they were nightmare rank players on to the next challenge now the four nightmare rank players have to complete in a thousand block parkour race at the end there are two dodo birds if you can get on a dodo bird you move to the finale where you go head to head against the other player for a thousand robux but the other players who fail to get on the dodo birds get banned Forever. All right, the players are racing. We have Vayne in the lead, but Vayne is uh, not figuring out how this parkour is going. We have Gorilla and Gorilla and Friend racing to the end. It's looking head to head. We have Gorilla and Friend at the end. Whoever can hop on these dodo birds gets the win. Gorilla, yo, but Vayne, oh no, Gorilla, Gorilla doesn't get, Gorilla doesn't get off the dodo bird. And Vane and Friend move to the finale. We started with eight and now we're left with two. Let's settle this in a good old 1v1 to see who gets the Robux. All right, it is time for the finale. This is gonna be a late game PVP versus the three. Friend versus Vane. Oh, it's time for a late game battle. These guys are a... Uh, they're just a little bit insane at this game, and they are playing like it. And so far, it's looking like Friend is ahead. Bro hasn't taken a lick of damage, while Vayne literally has half HP. He's trying his hardest to heal, but Friend is keeping the pressure on him. He is getting hit hard, and he- Oh my gosh, what a pearl clutch, but- Friend just completely is following him, refusing to let him run away. Oh my goodness, this guy is running with all his heart, might, mind, and strength. Vayne is playing insane. And it goes from Vayne being the person down to Vayne being the person up. Can Vayne, can Vayne catch the W, but friend keeps the constant pressure. Vayne is at 1 HP. He needs to find a way to survive against friend. He is running like his life depends on it, but he is not finding a way to survive. He gets hit off into the void. Friend, the W. 1-0, friend. All right, round two. It is first to three. Friend is up. But let's see if that's going to last for long. 
because Vayne is still one of the best players in the game. He can make a comeback as long as he gets a good start, but Fred is constantly applying pressure, and we're back into the same situation where Vayne is running away from Fred. Pearls away, builds away, but Vayne finds a way to come out on top, making it 1-1. 1-1, first to three. I have never seen a late game PvP this intense. They are yapping in chat, saying excuses, saying this, saying that. And uh, they're backing it up, apparently, because it is tied. Bro dies. Nice one, LOL, nice one. It is 2-1 friend. If friend wins this, he takes home the Robux. But if Bane wins this, he brings it into sudden death. Bane has that auto clicker enabled. He is finding a way to run away. And run away he does. Bro is building life. His life depends on it. And he is purling as well. He is finding a way to escape from Friend's wrath. Because if Vayne dies, he literally loses the Robux. I don't even have words for Vayne's running strat. Bro is finding a way to get out, bro. Friend is still good at chipping away at his health. This man is purling with his life. <gasps> but Vayne finally finds a way to heal. Bro has ran for long enough and Vayne is on the offensive. <gasps> but I don't know if I can keep that. I don't know if he can keep it up for long. Vayne is low on HP, but he is finding a way. But if there is a will, there is a way. And a thousand Robux is surely a good will to keep going. He is getting bowed. It doesn't matter how much wool you have. This man, friend's aim is insane. He misses the fireball. You cannot waste precious materials, especially in a fight like this. He's wasting more fireballs. He's running low. Oh, Vayne uses his fireball. He is chipping away at friend's HP. Friend is finding a way to clutch up. Friend has been on the offensive for too long. It's time for him to be on the defensive. It is 50-50 HP wise. This is getting down to the wire. But friend... <gasps> Oh my gosh, Fred finds a way to catch a W, and Friend wins. It was a close fight, but in the end, Friend is, is the top pro that survived. If you want to get good like Friend, feel free to go check this video out right here and subscribe on your way out. Have a great day.